Hey everyone, I don't even know if there's anyone here yet. I think there is, <laughs> maybe. But I am here at Facebook in Los Angeles doing a live stream, my first Facebook live stream actually ever, um, which I'm very excited about. And clearly, clearly people in the room are excited as well. Um, <laughs> I, um, I wanted to do this little quick Q&A just because I don't talk to you guys enough and I feel like you guys don't know enough about me. So. I think we should jump right into it, maybe with like basics of getting to know me. And I believe I have some on the iPad right here. Very simplistic, full name, Sean Patrick O'Donnell. I'm very Irish, as you can tell by that. Um, what's your nickname? I have a bunch. Um, like my classic nickname that like only my family knows me is Binky because I'm the younger brother and my older brother is mean um, and named me that a long, long time ago. Um, that and booze, my mom calls me booze, which sounds like I'm an alcoholic, but that's not at all what it is. Um, describe your fashion game in one word. <laughs> um, lazy, that's probably as accurate as I can make that. I'm literally just wearing a sweatshirt right now and some jeans. If I could wear blue jeans and a white tee every single day of my life, I would because it's simple and I can sleep in that and still look semi-presentable. Um, if you could time travel, would you go forward or backward? These are supposed to be easy questions. <laughs> wow, <laughs> all right. Um, I'd probably go forward because like the future and like flying cars and well it depends how far forward but I'm thinking way too much into this question the future is probably going to be really good or really bad but I'm hoping it's really good and I would love to see that and sadly I probably will expire before then um, so yeah I'd go forward no question call or text call I can't tell you how many times I've texted someone and because they can't hear the inflection in my tone they think I'm like angry at them and I'm like no stop like just trying to have a good Valentine's Day like this is totally not based off of what happened yesterday in my life it's cool it's cool it's whatever um, favorite place to shop the grocery store easy I love food I know that's more of like a closed question but the grocery store was the first thing that came to mind I went there this morning actually I go there quite frequently more than I should last book you read um, Water for Elephants. I've read it like 19 times. Um, it's, I probably should pick up a different book, um, but I just, it's my favorite book and I've read it a lot and I just read it like two months ago. But, so I don't, I don't read a lot of books actually because being an actor I read scripts a lot and that kind of takes the place of books. How many languages do you speak? I speak English and I took like four years of Spanish in high school, which basically means I know how to ask where the bathroom is, and that's about it, the extent of it, because, um, you know, public school. Um, last thing that made you laugh, uh, myself in the car. I am easily the funniest person that I know in existence, so I, uh, I was laughing pretty hard at a joke that I came up with in my head in the car, which is slightly embarrassing out loud to think about. Um, what movie do you wish you had been in? Mm. That is like... There's a lot of movies that I wish I had been in. If I could pick any movie, Perks of a Wallflower, Logan Lerman, mm. I wish I had that role. That would have been like dream role. You know, sad. Sad about it. Do you have a pet peeve? Okay, this is going to be like kind of gross, but not really. When people blow their nose... And then they take the tissue and look into it. Ugh. Why? Why do you do that? <laughs> like, what are you looking to find in that? I never noticed it until, like, the seventh grade. And my buddy David was just like, yo, watch Shelby Pickle right now. She's about to look into this tissue. I'm like, how do you know this? He's like, she's done it since she was, like, two years old. Now I can't not see it. And it freaks me out. Can't handle it. Introvert or extrovert? Introvert. I keep to myself. I, um which is weird, like being an actor and being in front of a lot of people, but like I'm a very reserved, very quiet, calm person. 
Yeah. Favorite magazine? Top Gear. British motoring company. TV show. TV show's not good anymore, I'm sorry. Um, but the magazine, it's just like, it's about cars and I'm just a nerd and it's amazing. Spicy or mild? I hate spicy food. I can't stand it. There is no fun in pain while you're eating. What is enjoyable about that? I've a lot of friends that love spicy food, really questioning being friends with them. Early bird or night owl? Night owl. My mother had to literally drag me from bed sometimes to actually go to school in the morning. So, yeah. Although I think we're going to move on to some questions from you guys. Thank you for this. Let's see. Favorite place to go in Los Angeles? Being like an introvert, again, I don't leave my apartment much. Uh, so, I don't know. Um, there is an overlook above the city, which is, it just looks over all of downtown Los Angeles and it's beautiful, specifically at night when I'm awake at two in the morning. Uh, it's where I definitely go. Um, let's see, what else is there? Can you speak Spanish? That'd be terribly embarrassing, so I'm gonna pass on that one. <laughs> um, my favorite food, potatoes, any form. Any style. Mashed potatoes, sweet potatoes, crushed potatoes, doesn't matter. Mm -hmm. Potatoes. Again, this plays into like being very, very, very Irish. Mm -hmm. um, ice cream or cake? I don't like cake. It's too cakey. <laughs> it's not a, not, a, not a thing for me. Um, <laughs> do you play video games? I love video games. I'm a huge nerd. It's something that not a lot of people know about me because I I'm a closeted nerd. Nothing wrong with being a nerd. Um, but I play a lot of video games. Easily like an hour or two, probably more. <laughs> I'm down playing this every day. Um, it's the way that I like interact with my brother and my family and friends back on the East Coast. Um, it's like staying connected. It's the best part about it. Um, can you speak French? I wish. I wish I took French in high school instead of Spanish, but like I worked in restaurants my entire life, and you have to speak Spanish when you work in restaurants. Um, it's just, it's how it is. Um, let's see. Last night's dream. It's actually funny you ask. I don't remember it, but I remember waking up and being like, damn, that was a good dream, and I'm pissed I don't remember it. So it was a struggle this morning. Um, Bieber is back on Instagram. Reactions? I honestly didn't know that. Um, <laughs> I hate to break it to you. Um, I don't follow. I'm not one of those people that follows like celebrities' lives uh, in any way, shape, or form. So I don't know that. Favorite TV show of all time? The West Wing, which came out in 99, which mm -hmm. probably is older than some of you, which is weird. Um, it's a show about the president and the office of the president, and it's amazing and like the greatest TV show ever, and I've watched it a lot. Do you like One Direction? <laughs> I do. I have no problem saying that. <laughs> um, favorite movie ever? The Parent Trap, Lindsay Lohan. No question. <laughs> it's just, oh God. I have a lot of people making fun of me in the room right now. I'm a little self-conscious, but I stand by it, and we're just gonna move on. Okay. Um, favorite song? Um, trombone Shorty, jazz player from New Orleans. He does a rendition of Oh Holy Night, which is like, you know, moves me to tears every single time I listen to it, which is, it's amazing. Um, how do you feel today? I feel great. I had a calendar launch today, which was amazing because it was the first time I'd ever like had a product out there in the world for people to like enjoy. Um, and when I was thinking about like things to present to the general public, I didn't want it to be like a shirt with like my name on it because who am I? Like I don't deserve that. Like what are you joking? Um, so I figured like a little piece of art, you know, and I um little 
sneak preview because I haven't told anyone this, but we're on Facebook Live, so I have to. Um, on the, the store where the, the calendars are, in the next week or two, I'm putting up, like, canvas prints of my photography. So, like, something you would hang, you know, like, above a fireplace or whatever. Um, and I'm very excited about that. Like, I can't even begin to tell you. Um, do you work out? I lift, like, a gallon of milk into my cereal bowl every morning. And that pretty much settles that. <laughs> um, let's see. Favorite place to chill and clear your mind? On the phone with my mother. I talk to my mom once a day usually, and she's the greatest. So she's definitely where I go to kind of like get things off my chest and relax a little bit. Um, let's see, let's see, let's see. Mm -hmm. Rom-coms or action movies? That's a great question, Claire. Um, I spent my entire life growing up watching rom-coms with my mother and it was painful because she would like break my arm because she would be crying hysterically so I'm going to go with action movies so that I don't have to relive those terrible memories um excited for summer yes I'm going to because I go home to Long Island and I love Long Island and and there's a Long Islander here that's awesome what do you prefer California or New York this is going to be my last question but it's got to be New York. Like, California's great. Los Angeles is a fantastic place to live. But Long Island is, well, home, A. My family's there, and, you know, nothing beats that. But Long Island is the greatest. If you've never been, go. I'm not saying Nassau, and I'm really sorry if anyone here is in Nassau because it's just not the greatest place. But Suffolk County, like, out east, whew, nothing better. And I appreciate everyone showing up and asking some questions. I need to do this more and I will do this more because we don't do this enough. I don't get to interact with you guys enough. But thank you guys for stopping by and all the questions and I will talk to you guys in the next one.